What's up, beautiful people? Um, Sunday morning, Springfield, Massachusetts. Raheem Escalade. This is episode 194 of 4 and 3 Sports Talk. Good to be with you. Good to bring this to you. I happen to be sitting outside of MGM, obviously. Um, in the little, this little park. I think this little area to come and sit down and regroup and everything is freaking awesome. And I think it's beneficial to anybody who's doing mindfulness or any type of uh, relaxation, any type of training, any type of anything to get right. This is definitely a place to uh, come down and do that. Um, Red Rose is right there, so you know, I might get a little hungry and try to order a little pregame meal or something like that. Who knows? Um, anyway, today I have Western Mass Sports coverage, uh, NCAA basketball from the men and women's, um, NHL scores, scores from NBA, and um, yeah, that's it. That's what I got. So let's get into it. A couple stories from the news. Um, Big Ben placed on COVID-19 list. He's out versus the Detroit Lions. I think Detroit's going to win this game today. Um, Panthers acting as if Sam Donald is out for the rest of uh, 2021. Um, I believe he might be. Um, it's probably why they re-signed Cam Newton again. Um, and I think that Cam's going to really embrace this this time around in Carolina. I think um, the Panthers are actually going to go on a type of a streak, a win streak. Um... My guy, Timmy, nets 37 points as the Zags stomp Texas. You know I'm a big Gonzaga Bulldogs fan. Uh, shout out to you, most definitely, Coach Mark Few. You're my guy. I know you went through something a couple weeks ago, but fuck the law. We had a couple drinks, and you weren't unsafe for anybody. Uh, Mark Ingram, only needing 20 yards, can become the New Orleans Saints' all-time leading rusher today as Alvin Kamara is downgraded to out. Um, go Mark Ingram, get that rushing title. I know it means a lot to you. Um, it means a lot to Saint to fans down there in uh, NOLA. And finally, number one, number 13, Baylor upsets number four, Oklahoma Sooners, 27-14. We'll talk more about that <coughs> um, when we get into these scores and the rest of the episode in 194. Starts now. Uh, again, just hope you all are well. Enjoying your day. Really hype. Got to be hyped. Or some uh, sports will get you hyped and start with that. Um, in soccer, uh, field hockey, actually, we have Walpole 5, watch you sit nothing. And over 1, Shrewsbury nothing. And that concludes field hockey scores. Now let's move on to girls soccer. Uh, West Bridgewater 3, Pope Francis 2. Uh, Munson 6, Millis 1. Bishop Feehan 3, Wellesley 2. Uh, Plymouth North 5, Grafton 0. Uh, Belchertown 2, Stoneham 1. Uh, Dedham 5, Groton 1. Foxborough 1, Ursuline 0. What a nice name for a school. Hingham 3, Algonquin 0. Uh, Sutton 2, Brumfield 1. Uh, Silver Lake 2, Danvers 1. And Whitman 2, Milford 1. Right, moving on to boys soccer. West Side 3, Hopkinson 2. Uh, Clinton 1, Canton 1, Amherst 0. Um, Belchertown 2, uh, Greater New Bedford 0. Uh, Brookline 2, St. John's Prep 1. Uh, Brumfield 2, Mount Greylock 0. Uh, East Hampton 2, Pope Francis 1. Uh, Long Meadow 3, Mass Kanamit 1. Uh, Concord 2, Ludlow 0. And uh, Frontier 1, Cohasset 0. 0 for Cohasset. Now, that is it for Western Massachusetts sports. Uh, moving on to NCAA football. Uh, Cincy 45, USF 28, Alabama 59, NMSU 3, Mississippi State upsets the Auburn Tigers, my Auburn Tigers, uh, 43-34, um, Michigan 21, Penn State 17, what a great game, uh, Wisconsin 35, NU 7, uh, Baylor 27, Oklahoma 14, wow, 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 uh, Utah 38, Arizona 29, uh, Georgia 41, Tennessee 17, UTSA 27, Southern Miss 17, Iowa 27, Minnesota 22, uh, Ohio State 59, Purdue 31, no upset this week for Purdue, uh, Michigan State 40, Maryland 21, Ole Miss 29, Texas A&M 19, in overtime Arkansas beats LSU 16 to 13, um, Notre Dame all over Virginia 28 to 3. Uh, Wake Forest over NC State at the end, 45-42. 
Oklahoma State all over TCU 63-17. Oregon 38, Washington State 24, and San Diego State University 23, Nevada 21. And that concludes NCAA football scores. Now on to basketball on the men's side. UConn 89, uh, COPP 54, Maryland 68, well, 57. Arkansas 86, George Webb 69, Memphis 90, NCCU 51, Duke 67, Camp 56, Michigan 77, PV 49, and Gonzaga 86, Texas 70, 70, 74. Um, moving on, NCAA basketball women's number one, Michigan beats St. Francis College 82 to 46. And those conclude your NCAA women's basketball scores. NBA, we have Miami Heat over Utah, 110-105. Indy, 118. Philly, 113. Washington, 104. Oregon, 92. NOLA, 112. Memphis, 101. Detroit, 127. Toronto, 121. Uh, Cleveland, 91. Boston Celtics, 89. You guys lose because you guys suck. Uh, Clippers over the Timberwolves, 129-102. Um, for the NFL, see my picks video. I posted it already. And finally, in the NHL, Buffalo, Buff, Boston 5, New Jersey 2, Toronto 5, Buffalo 4, Ottawa 6, Pittsburgh 3, Detroit 3, and Montreal 2 in overtime when Tampa Bay beats Florida in overtime by the same score. Uh, Rangers 5, Jets 3, um, Winnipeg 3, Los Angeles Kings 2, Carolina 3, St. Louis Blues 2, uh, Nashville 4, Arizona 1. Dallas 5, Philly 2, Colorado 6, San Jose 2, Vegas Knights all over Vancouver 7-4, and finally Minnesota 4, Seattle 2. And that concludes episode 194 of 4 and 3 Sports Talk. I'm your host, Raheem Escalai. 38 subscribers on YouTube. Let's try to get those up there. And also, we're trying to spread our show on Facebook. Let everybody know that 4 and 3 Sports Talk is the best sports show on the East Coast, or is almost going to be pretty soon. Um, I love you all. Wish you nothing but health, wealth, and success. Look out for episode 195 tomorrow evening. Monday evening, that is. Um, excuse me. When some of those Western Mass Sports games get done being played. So check check um, check us out again. And we shall have episode 195 by 5 p.m. Sunday evening. Love you all. Wish you nothing but health, wealth, and success. Go Pack Go. Um, fuck the Patriots. Fuck the Cowboys. And I hope you all enjoy your Sunday.